Hello and welcome to today's video. We got something a little bit different for you guys for uh, K-pop related items. Uh, but here's what the box is. Uh, it says Red Velvet Summer Magic on it. And then the back of it is this. So what this is, is a package of things. Uh, so let's just open it. Uh, but basically it comes with card holder, a little card we'll talk about, a mirror, and a lanyard. So, I'm gonna open the box up. All right, there we go. So, the first thing we got here is the lanyard, which looks pretty cool. So, all the names of the members of Red Velvet on it. It's got a little attachy thing here. Then you have this, which is a little card holder. Uh, which it says it has anti-skimming technology. So that way nobody can steal your card numbers. Uh, but what you do with this is I guess you just attach it on here. And then you can be an epic swag lord and walk around with this. I don't know why I said that. Uh, but, yeah. I'm not going to put it all together because it just stays in this box. But uh, there's a little card holder thingy. It looks like you can put three cards in it. Two in the front and one in the back there. Uh, this is a pretty quick video because there's not really much we have to look into detail of. But what we do have is this card, which is called a Cash B card. So uh, there are things in the back of it, but they're numbers, and I don't know what they're important for, so I don't really just want to be like, hey, look at these card numbers that I have just because they could be important for something. Um, it did come with this little paper explaining what it is, um, but I looked it up on the internets, and these cards are like for transportation and things in Korea, for buses and subways and things like that. So it says there's cash fee or tea money cards that you can buy, buy at convenience stores and the person who wrote the article said uh, they work separately, but they work on different machines. So there's cash fee machines and tea money machines, but there's no difference and you don't need to buy both. And they work on subways, taxes, taxes, taxis, and buses. Uh, and uh, yeah, so this could be charged. So I guess you can just use the cards when you go to uh, subways. And buses. But yeah, they don't really know what the numbers are important for, that's why I didn't show the back of it. It also comes with a mirror here, which does something. Well, it does what mirrors do. Um, so here you go. Um, <laughs> this is the back of it. It's got the same design as this has on it. But apparently, you're supposed to peel this layering off right here, which I'm doing. Because I'm like, that doesn't really work well as a mirror on the other side. And there you go, it's an epic mirror. Look at that, I'm recording with my phone. So you can look in the mirror and you can be like, wow, I'm really cool. Um, but yeah, so it comes with a mirror as well. So that is actually that. It's a pretty short video. But I just figured I'd show it because I bought this and, you know, you know how it be. Um, so yeah, that's that. We should have one more. Or not one more. We should have like three more k-pop videos this year i believe three more in 2018 i have packages that are set to be delivered on the 31st so we'll see how that turns out but uh there are things that are supposed to be here on the 31st so i'm not really sure uh they will be here by then but oh yeah look how nice and neat it goes into the packaging as well So that should be here by the 
31st, and then someone should be here by the 3rd. Uh, and then we should be close to having everything done uh, with what I've ordered. And I do have one more thing that has not been sent yet. I did get another thing, but I have to wait for the other half of the order. Uh, I ordered from two different places, and one place sent it out. It started here, and one place has not sent it out yet. Uh, and then the last thing, I do plan on making an order before the end of the year. So, when that arrives, we will do a video of that in the beginning of January. And then we'll have a video in mid-January, which should recap everything that I purchased this year. So, look out for that in the middle of January. Uh, where we take a look at everything that I purchased in 2018. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed, and we'll see you guys in the next one.